Fine, you will find what works for you, okay? Two and a half hips width. If you have your feet too splayed, when you stand up, you'll fall on your arms. As soon as you lean back, you'll fall over, okay? If you have your feet too far forward, you can't extend your knees out, and you'll basically turn into a shit conventional, okay? You want to have your knees, your legs be up 45-ish, thereabouts, okay? Let's get out a little bit. Now, for this, you want to be right on the bar, not off the bar, okay? It's the biggest difference, be right on the bar. Your shins need to be touching your bar the entire movement, all right? Same brace, my arms are close to their inside leg. Okay, we take our breath. My arms go long. When I go down to the bar, I hinge, and my knees go out. Okay, your knees collapse, you push the bar away, that prevents a super bench. Okay, so we take our breath. Knees are out. Okay, eyes down to the bar, we find our position. Okay, from here, we pull up, up. Tension, tension, okay? I raise straight, got my tension. I'm pushing my knees and my feet through the ground and out in the angle of my feet. Okay? My knees go out the angle of my feet and my feet drive the angle that they are in, driving the ground away, like a leg press. Okay? So rather than driving up, I'm driving out. So if I'm here, as I, as I engage, I'm driving away. And then my hips are through. Okay, breath. Here, tension. Eyes are up. When I get to that 110, I'll be engaged from here. Okay, here. Clear my knees, hips 